What's up, guys? It's kimchi. And tofu. Yeah! yeah. All right, guys, we are going into Parasite episode number bam, bam. 11. Called the Bluebird. On the last episode, we left off with our, our genius Yuko planned this whole school massacre. Definitely a super dark episode. And now we officially have a haunted school. Haunted school, that is. Yeah. yeah. Damn, dude, I wouldn't want to go back to that school. No, hell no. <laughs> yeah, could you imagine? Dude, even the kids going back to school, already just that. They're scarred for life. Damn, dude, I was like, nah, screw that. Dude, I ain't going back. I'm transferring school right away. Yeah. Yeah. But cool. All right, guys, we're going to episode number 11. Thank you, as always, for joining Kim Kim Tofu. Are you ready? I'm ready. Are you ready? All right, let's go start the show. Oh, no. Are these the next victims of parasites? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. The, the, the hair. Yeah. Oh, yeah. <gasps> oh, oh no. shoot, run, girl, run. Uh, yeah. Get out. Dang. Ooh. <laughs> Dang, she's a picky eater. I know, right? Not meat that contains alcohol. These parasites would not survive in Korea. Yeah, because everyone's drinking soju. Yeah. Damn, that's right. So Korea will be safe. She don't like oolong tea, huh? <laughs> She won't make me kiss her in front of camera, guys. Dude, I think I really look like Hizoka, huh? You do. Oh, damn. That's why it's not right if you kiss me. <laughs> oh, yeah. Whoa, where is this? Is that Kana? Oh, yeah, that looks like her. I'm guessing this is a dream. Oh. Oh, 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 wait. This looks familiar. Oh, Goblin Slayer? Yeah. Oh, what yeah, the hell? Ah, look at the horse. Oh That's a parasitic God. horse. Oh, shoot, it is. The face of Shinichi, right? Oh, no. 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 So she a fortune? Yo, it that, looks that like is Shinichi. Shinichi. Yo. Look at her, all naked. <laughs> They went zero to a hundred real quick. Uh, oh, mm. Hot damn, she had a wet dream. Yeah, I was, about, I was thinking that. <laughs> I think this is going to make her even more infatuated with him. I think she's starting to put two and two together. Yeah, that Shinichi is one of the parasite. <gasps> she's going to pull her hair. Don't do it. Yeah. Nice. Because it's not a part of his brain or head, right? Uh, I think so. Either that or more of he's just special special kind. She saved makes... his hair. Yeah, she's... Of course. Oh, yeah, Miggy will kill her. Damn, yep. Miggy's anti-simp. Yep. He's gonna have to wait till Miggy's asleep. No, don't do that. Yes. Oh gosh. That's just asking to get killed. I think all these girls just want to get killed. <laughs> I think they're all just thirsty. <laughs> Oh, she's uh getting jealous. Shinichi, mo ano onna to wa hanasu na. Kimi no hanashikata wa katappashi kara boro ga dete iru kanji nanda yo. Tozen da. Yeah, this is no superhero movie. <laughs> no. Konna koto ikinari kiku no mo hen desu kedo. Anata ga saisho ni atta koro to ima to suki nan desho. Kare no koto. Girl, this has nothing to do with that. Yeah. <laughs> Dreams. Uh -huh. <laughs> That's all she can think about, man, girls. Man. 
Oh, this guy looks like a parasite. No, he doesn't look like it. His eyes. Oh, yeah, I think so. Listen to him. Not the blonde, but him. Oh, Yakuza, never mind. Whoa, okay. Yeah, you're right. He just did that with his hand. This guy is lucky for the body he got. Yeah, this parasite got the lucky one, huh? Yeah. He's like, damn, I got a good body. That's why he's flexing in that outfit. Whoa. Whoa dude. Woo. Oh, oh. Oh, I thought he was going to oh, rip it out of his... his head is off! Body. Dude, this guy is actually stronger than normal parasites. This isn't normal. He's not normal. He, obviously, he's not normal. Look at it. Like, Shinichi not normal. Uh. Wow! That was cool. Oh, my gosh. Whoa! Damn! Whoa. Ah. Uh, no. 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 Wait, what? He got him in the brain, though. Remember, parasites, you need to get him in the heart to kill him. This is just a test. What? Experiment. Look at that smile. No! <laughs> yeah, let's run after him, guys. So I wonder if this guy's like a Shinichi, right? Yeah. Yeah. Oh no. Oh no. He changed face? Yeah, he just morphed. Yep. Yeah. He changed his whole body. Wow. Yeah. yeah. He switched bodies. I thought he could only change face. But he's changed the whole body too. Dude, that's OP then. Yeah. Yeah, that guy didn't eat any of them. Boss. Oh. Wow. We got a whole gang yeah. of parasite. <laughs> no horror. So you took you a mega summit to Kuray Katomanai. And the more Asanian to Hotondo was written. Keko Hakiri or Boyterenda. That's her dreams? She has nightmares. Or nightmares, yeah. Because she saw the guy. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do let any come at me. その友達ってどんな人人っていうかその友達の影響かなあ、ごめんそんな変わったって言っても気になるほどじゃん旅に出たっきりまだああいやいつか旅先でお父さんが怪我して行こうかあ、I Oh. Man, freaking parasite like, trying to troll us? Yeah. Damn, I thought something was gonna attack her. Me like, remember too. that episode one, the dog parasite? Yeah. Uh oh. I feel like. Is she a parasite? No. Hold on. It's something about his mom, because he feels. Remember? Oh. It's his mom. Shinichi would have said something to him that a parasite is coming. Right. That's true. So what is it? Like PTSD? Yeah. Oh, they're holding hands. And she's kind of going to see this. They're kissing! They kiss! Of course, these two have to be together. Damn, man. And Kana even looked pretty fly with her new outfit, too. Yeah, and showing some cleavage. <laughs> yeah, right? She was ready. Yeah. Damn, she's so... She... She thinks this is, like, not him? Mm -mm. She's such a stalker. <laughs> <laughs> wow, so she doesn't stop even though she knows that's hers, huh? I mean, that's not hers anymore. Mm. Wow. Three. Oh shoot! It must be them. Oh, the gangsters. Five. 
Global nature consensus. Oh man! Been caught. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, a full group of parasites. He's watching him now. This is not good. Mazui, Mazui. Now the parasites are running for mayor. They're trying to take over the world. Yeah, they are going to take over the world. That's what they're thinking. They're smart. So they're trying to take over the most powerful position. How did they even get together and plan to form this, though? The I boss, I mean, obviously there's a boss in here. Right. Right? And that boss was probably talking talking to the girl the last time. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Prob okay, yeah. Probably that's what's happened. And sh and remember that boss calls humans toxins. Mm-hmm. And look at the way that they're running. They're running um, like for nature, nature pro-earth. Pro-earth. <gasps> so that means that everybody that's running for pro-earth right now, we got to be careful for them. Yep. Could be all parasites. Parasites. Wow. Ooh. Nah. What if it's like, like, or even the pol politicians? You never know. Remember what they always say? Like, they could be uh, lizard men. Lizards. Yeah. Mark Zuckerberg could be a lizard. <laughs> oh my gosh. So they're trying to take over the world. Mm -hmm. But right now, Shinichi is worried about Kana. Because if she senses them and him, she's going to tie it all together again. Because then she's going to be attracted to them. And then she could get killed. She's like stupid, in yeah. a sense. Right? Yeah. Yeah. Damn, so they're trying to take over the world in a in a smart way, in a slow slow way. Instead of just going on a killing rampage, they're actually using their brain on this. Yes and no. What do you mean yes and no? Because they just had an experiment where they just went in and killed a bunch of Yakuza to see if they could go against weapons. Yeah, but the boss was saying you, like, you kind of went a little bit too far. All right. Like, you could go test your bodies out. Or it's like, wait, if it was an experiment, that means that they got something new. They have to because... So, because of the way that this guy moved, there's no way that he's a normal parasite. This is a problem because it looks like this, whatever this morph is, is that it's Shinichi. It's the same thing as Shinichi, but at the same time, it's not because they can morph their whole body, not just their face, but their whole body too. Yeah. And that's more dangerous because that means that they can get away with so many things now. Right. And they got Shinichi superpowers. Yes. Where did they even get this though? That's the question. I have no idea. It's like, you know, when a virus, um, it changes and morphs into a new virus and it becomes stronger and harder to battle. I feel like that's what's going on with this parasite. I think this parasite somehow like some evolved yeah. in, in a sense? Evolved. Hmm. I, I mean, it's either that or they found a couple people like Shinichi. They, or, but it feels like it's like the body, the lower body. Right? Yeah. It has to be the lower body because if you saw him when he got cut on his arm, this is the part that moved. Yes. Yeah. And it's his body that was strong. Right, right. And when he took over the other body, he didn't just take the head. He took the whole body. It's everything. Yeah. So this is like some advanced level parasites. Yes. Mm, mm, that's not good. How no. the hell is Shinichi going to fight this guy? <laughs> I have no There's no idea. way because, I mean, who else does he have? Right. And he's by himself and he's going against eight people. Parasites so far. Yeah, eight organized parasites. Yeah. Not even just parasites that's alone doing their own thing. It's organized parasites. He has to somehow get close with, with Kana too, in a sense. Because she is a sensory type. Yes. She could be useful when Kana... Uh, she could be useful when Shinichi's sleeping. Right. But Miggy doesn't feel that way. So he can't ask her that yet or else he'll kill her. And plus, not only that, is that she saw him and, you know, her and Murano... Uh, kind of. I guess they're officially dating now. They're official. Yeah. yeah. They went. On a, they went on a full date. They kissed. Man, so that girl kind of she's pretty savage though, man. You know, it's like she already saw that and then she's keep dialing him. She's like, I don't she care. She don't care. But she said that she has one last question. Ah, uh, one then last she'll question. She'll leave him alone. Oh yeah, exactly. That's right. And then that's probably gonna ask if he's a parasite or not. Or it's either that or do you love Murano? Yes. Do you think it's that one? Yeah. Do you okay. like Murano or do you like me? Ah, I see. I see. Damn, that's, this is tricky because he needs her too. Yes. Yeah, but that was that was fun. We got a little bit of drama in this episode. We did. We got a lot of little uh, triangle love drama. Yes. Damn. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So with Murano, what's crazy is that you know Murano is actual love because with Kana, she 
she can tell that that's not Shinichi or whatever just by sense by her sensory, mm-hmm. right? Whereas Murano, she can tell it's not Shinichi because she just knows who he is. Right. So she's gonna piece together who Shinichi, what Shinichi really is, just by you know, by just knowing who he is, but just yes. by her senses. Right. And Kana is gonna find out by her special senses. So special senses. <laughs> that makes her have wet dreams. <laughs> uh, yeah, wet dreams. Damn, dude, that's pretty cool. I want that wet dreams. <laughs> You know? Yeah. Almost thought we had a Goblin Slayer episode. Yeah, it looked like it for a second. But all right, cool. That was episode number 11. Thank you guys so much for joining us. We will see you guys soon for episode number 12. Till then, have a great day. Stay safe. And we will see you guys next time, guys. Yes, we'll see you guys next time. Bye. Bye. What's up, guys? It's Kim Che. And Tofu. Yeah. All right, guys, we're going into Parasite, episode number 12, called Kokoro. Last episode, we had Greta Thunberg. We confirmed that she was a parasite. So they have this whole politician uh, group, this gang of parasites that's getting together yeah, to dominate four. the world. Yep, exactly. Yeah. And then we also got, uh, we've got two girls curled in this love triangle. Mmm, yeah, that's right. She's, Kana's gonna be asking her, what is she gonna ask her? She's gonna ask her, like, do you love me or do you love Murano, right? Maybe. That's probably the question, right? Because that's the only thing on her mind. Let's hope that's what it is, and it's not because of the parasites being in that same area and her being able to sense the energy. Oh, I see the whole energy of it. Yeah. But all right, cool. We're going into episode number 12. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Also, guys, guess what? We already started Black Clover. Yes, for those of you guys who didn't get the message. We have a second channel with the group. Called Ojingas. Uh, we'll leave the link down in the description down below. So make sure you guys check it out. We already started Black Clover on that channel. So I know there's uh, some of you guys that's been really, really, really requesting Black Clover. So if you haven't gotten the message, here it is. We did start Black Clover. So make sure you guys check it out and subscribe to that channel. Yes, yeah. we'll leave the link in the description below. Yes. Oh, cool. All right, guys. Tofu, are you ready? I'm ready. All right, let's go. go. Oh, we're back to her dream. Whoa, we're back at this dream again? Is she having it for a second time? Damn, this girl on a wet dreams though. <laughs> uh, wait. It is again. Yeah. What does she keep that handkerchief on the side for? <laughs> yeah, what's that handkerchief on the side for? I think that is confirming it's wet. <laughs> You're not supposed to be turning hot em, okay? It's your fault. I'm, I'm the only it. one that's allowed to be hot em. See that guy's tofu going hot em now. Wait, did he already have a date with her? Yeah, I guess it's done. Oh, so it was his curiosity or he just been studying a lot so he got into politics, that's why? Not because he wants to dominate or have power? Oh. So they won't get killed, right? Because killing a politician that put that creates an uproar. Man, the soundtrack's different than usual. Oh, oh. Oh. It's a good thing Miki doesn't know what he's thinking. Yeah, but he's probably thinking, you thinking about that girl again? <laughs> yeah. That looks like a grown-up him. Mm. Oh, that's the girl that he went to her. Oh, okay. I thought she was stalking him. Me too. ただのおじさんだったりとか。ペットとかで噂になってるパラサイトだっていうの。イズミもパラサイトだっていうの。うん。そんなこと。なあ。密を。ちょっと待ってよ。知らないことちょっと待ってよ。<笑><笑> しんいちさっき言ってたちゃんと話したいことってなんだそれなら私を危険にさらすようなことはしないでほしいわかってるよ本当に分かっているのか右上自分の右手が人を切り刻むところなんて見たくないだろうって本当超のかけらもないなだから
Ah, just, just get rid of her. Oh, oh! Oh no! Ah, so she survived. That lady didn't chase her down. So lucky, dude. Why is she doing that? She's playing with flyer, fire. <laughs> He's testing if Mika's asleep. Oh, wait. He's telling her everything. Straight up. Oh, snap. すぐに信じろって言う方が無理かもしれないけど。どんな風に右手の形が変わるのか。だから今は。ああ、エフィシオシーだ。ね、だからなんだ。ラストシーンユーシー。そんなことのためにこんな込み入った嘘をつくわけ
かり喋らない方がいいとても人には言えないからあー OK I was not expecting this that soon Damn I was expecting that soon too <laughs> I mean, that's what she gets for playing with fire too much. Yeah. But still, though, like, damn. At least get killed by, like, a badass parasite. That's a random parasite, too, right? Right. Wow, look at that pop, dude. He's like just as strong as that buff guy. Yeah. Or probably maybe even stronger. Oh, damn, of course. Dude. <laughs> he had to punch him. Because mm -hmm. Migi was going to do something. Right. Migi was like, dude, it's time. Yeah, that's right. Oh, he said he's been through so much at the same time, too. It's like more anger. Damn, for now. Oh, Damn. Wow, Kana's dead. Yeah. Wow. So, I mean, I, you know. She's been playing with fire, like, she had it coming. She kept on going after parasites or the sense that she was sensing, even after Shinichi told her not to. Yeah, so. it was that obsession with love yeah. that Obs got her killed. Yes. Yeah. What is that word? Love kills or something? Killing me softly with his love. <laughs> yeah. That's the wrong lyrics, by the way. It's killing me softly with his words. Oh, his words. Yeah. Even on the last part, Shinichi like had to hit him too because Migi was like, "Yo, he's hitting you. I think I gotta go kill him." Right, right? because he's starting to take damage. Yeah, da damage. That's right. But then that's why Shinichi had to punch him. But then you're right though. Shinichi went through a lot. He went through so much. He lost his mom too. Remember? Mm -hmm. Yeah. So he lost his mom to a parasite. He also lost to lost his. Uh, I don't know if he really liked Kana or something, but he just thought of her as a really good friend. Yes, the whole um, high school massacre. We're seeing all the students killed right, right. in the bloodbath. Like, he's just seen so many people die, and as well as killed so many parasites that are like humans, that I just feel like even if he didn't have a parasite inside of him, he would still go numb. He's just so numb to it. It's not about shedding tears at this point. It's more of anger now. Right. Right? It's more of vengeance. No. What I thought was that when Shinichi was giving Kana the information about him and the being a parasite, I thought something bad was going to happen where later on, you know how how uh, she always keeps on stalking him, and then she's gonna get rejected. She's gonna get all tired of it, yeah. and then she's just gonna spill it out to everybody. Oh yeah. She's gonna spill the information out, and that's gonna come back to him. But what happened was it, it wasn't. Right. And knowing Kana now, looking at her now, just seeing how obsessively in love she was with Shinichi, mm -hmm. till the death, till the last breath. I don't think something that she would tell anybody. No. Yeah, she wouldn't tell anybody. Yeah, I didn't think that she was going to die. I thought that maybe it was going to be those people running for president that were going to kill her. Yeah, someone like them. Yeah. Not like a random Paris like. No. Yeah. But then the way they directed that part was like when Shinichi's in one place and she's in the other place and she's like so happy, to, excited to see him. It's like, oh, I can feel him. I can feel him. But then, no, it wasn't. She didn't feel it. It wasn't. Oh. Right. It's, but she got what she wanted. She wanted him to sense her. <laughs> yeah. And he did. He and did. he's kind of saved her. Right. He did. I'm just wondering, though, but then when she said that she knows the difference between Shinichi and other parasites, she figured it out after she saw that one lady. Right. Right? So... The only way we could have tested this theory was using the other guy that has the chin parasite. The chin parasite or when she... It says when she really, really focused, mm -hmm. then she sends out these... Little the particles, signals, signals, signals yeah. out. Right, mm. for parasite to send her. I it's wonder, almost like meditating. Yeah, but yeah. Right. Yeah. And I wonder if there's other humans like her that can do the same thing as well. I know. It, I wish she told us where did they even get the power. Right. Or where did that even come from? She has no parasites in her. She has nothing. And she just randomly has this power, but that never explains how she got it or 
why she has it or does other people have it as well? Well, that's like with us in the human ro- world and uh, the mediums. <laughs> yeah, yeah, the medium. The psychics. The psychics. Right? Yeah. That's right. Yeah. You're just like, how did you get that power? Damn. Is it true or is it a scam? <laughs> I, I I don't I I don't know if it's real. Is it real? You think it's real? I think maybe. Maybe. I don't know. I'm still indecisive about it. They know it. the true secrets in this world. Right. Damn. Because sometimes they get this stuff right. Look at Shinichi's strength. The oh, way yeah, that yeah. he went against the parasite, he mm-hmm. was able to tag team with Miggy. Mm-hmm. But he killed the parasite with his own hand that didn't have Miggy in it. It's almost like uh, he's stronger than Miggy in a sense. Yeah. Right. And I think that's what he meant by at the end of the episode talking about how Shinichi, not Shinichi, Miggy's brain or his little cells have transferred up to his brain where he fully can't cry anymore. Wait. So does that mean he's turning into a full parasite then? No, because his hair hasn't changed yet. Yeah, his hair hasn't changed, but his cells are going up to his brains now. So he's not able to sense or have emotion, right? Yeah. But he still has anger. He's ang- He can get angry. He just can't cry. He can't cry anymore. He can't feel sad or anything. So he's losing that hu- human blood. Or not, not human blood. Human sympathy. Because when he was bleeding, that's, what, that's when he says, Oh, my blood is red for now. Yeah, but are oh. parasites blood red? <laughs> that's why I'm confused. Oh, no, it's just, I just, it's a figure of speech saying that, you know, she's human. When you oh. bleed, you, you, you know, you, you ever see? You bleed seen, red. Yeah, you bleed red, right? Not like green, like alien? No, yeah, yeah. And also, you know, it's like, you know, do you bleed? Ah. You're human. Does, bleeding makes you human. Still kind of kind of the same. But he oh, is okay. losing that hu- human sympathy or right. sense. So in the in later mm-hmm. on, will he be a full out, like a Miggy? If someone just hits him a little bit, then he's just going to kill him right on the spot. Right. You know? Because he had to say, we have to stop or else we're going to put a heart in the, a hole in this guy's heart too. Exactly. So he had so to control himself as well. Is, is, does that mean, is he becoming, will he become a villain later? Knowing Shinichi, he'll kill himself before he even turns out like that. Right. But will Miki stop him from killing himself? That's actually a really good question. Right? Yeah. You know, what will, will you see like Miki and Shinichi now go at it because Shinichi doesn't want to live like this anymore. He's trying to kill himself before he becomes a monster, but Miki doesn't want to die. Yeah, Miki doesn't want to be worse than a, a parasite that he you already know? is. Yeah. <laughs> no. But cool. All right, guys, that was Parasite episode number 12. Thank you guys so much for joining us. Also, one more reminder, guys, Ojinga's channel as a group channel. Make sure you guys subscribe to it. The link will be down in the description down below. Um, so make sure you guys come by, check us out for Black Clover. We are actually uploading Black Clover frequently on that channel too. So yes, yeah. So and we'll be starting a Korean drama. Yeah, Korean drama too. Yeah. Crash landing on you. Mm, mm. I can't wait. Yeah, I can't wait to start that one, guys. So yeah, make sure you guys look forward for that. See you guys at over at Ojingos too as well, guys. Thank Bye. you guys. Bye.